Hi guys, welcome back to another video from Dr. Crazy Sense. In this video, I'll be showing you guys a DIY which I built. This is a safe, a locker, an electronic safe. Uh, on the front part, I'll just do a review on this. Then we'll just see the uh, internal connections. On the front part, we have two LED lights. One is the red and one is the green. And uh, we have uh, uh, a handle. It's strong and we have a keypad which is an electronic keypad and then now let's see the side on this side we don't have anything else except the nails and uh, i have smoothened it by, by using the sandpaper uh, you can just get it in the stove in the hardware stores and uh, just see the back piece and this is the back side of the safe uh, as you can see this also smooth and as you can see there are two switches on this side one is to control uh, the Arduino, I mean the safe. The other one is an internal light, an LED light. And now let's see the other side. We have a battery, an I want battery. Uh, you can just remove it, in, it's a rechargeable one. And the switch connections and also uh, there are some nails and this is the battery compartment. I made this uh, because I can uh, take this as a portable safe. And as you can see there are two handles also, I'll just show you to carry it. I'll just show you a bit later and you can uh, connect the battery and you can just carry it and go and also you can use it as wired by connecting an adapter and now let's see the top part uh, this is the top part of the safe uh, I'll just show you these are the two handles I mean the, you, which you can carry as you can see it's easy to lift so even the battery doesn't hang it comes with uh, this uh, thing I made this self uh, stand I hot glue only this I hot glued others all are fixed by nails as you can see now this is sealed front and it's smooth and now let's see the internal one internal uh, connections before that I just on it and I'll just show you and guys now I'm gonna on the switch uh, just go and I'll just on it you can see you just focus on the two LED light the down bottom switch as you can see the green blinked and the red comes and now the system is on uh, now when you open it and you like pull it harder it doesn't come as you can see because it's locked just type the password this uh, the password is 820 just type 820 when i type 0 the green light will come uh, and another thing guys you can change the password whenever you want as you can see the green light comes and it's smooth you can open it guys only the wiring connection this side and uh, the other stuff you can store is that side I'll just on the internal light which I said the switch is that side I'll just on it oops uh, I'm sorry guys because the battery power was low the light is not working I'll make sure that I'll show you the light uh, in the in the last part so don't worry guys now let's just see the internal connection over here we have the lock the lock uh, just to show you easy lock uh, we have a servo motor which is connected to the lock using a wire piece of wire and uh, here the servo motors are connected and this keypad and the keypad I have drilled a hole and uh, took the wires of the keypad and connected to the Arduino and as you can see I have uh, connected the 300 uh, the uh, ampere, I mean, no, this one, a uh, resistor over here. Uh, the, this is the green and the red light, and also uh, the Arduino. As you can see, the two lights are blinking the Arduino the green and uh, the red, I mean, the orange. And I have just separated this piece by using a piece of cardboard, just hot glue it. Uh, now, I'll just show you. And the lock button is this is the lock button. I'll just show you once I click this. Uh, the light will turn on, turn to the red, and this will move. I'll just show you. Show the proof. See now. As you can see, the light turns to red, and it's locked in place. If you try to move it; it doesn't get moved because of the servo motor. I'll just put the password again: eight two zero. And this, or oh, either this, is the lock button. And as you can see it opens, let's just see from this side. 
how it works I'll just press the button and you see the server motor will rotate and push this as you can see guys it just did that and it's a good torque server motor and I'll just show you uh, the internal uh, space and guys this the, this is the internal space as you can see over there I have the LED light fixed I'll just charge the battery and uh, show you the LED light and I'll just show you the review inside the safe and guys now I have charged the battery and I'm back and now I'll just on the LED switch as you can see the light works uh, and these are the things I have just kept some of my important information like like a cash and all inside this purse I have some cash uh, so I just keep like that so I, I'll just the LED is just connected and goes back I'll show you the it goes back and then it comes in the other way it goes left and even that power cable uh, the black one which comes like this even that goes I'm not using the flash of the phone uh, it's the light is this one it's so bright and as you can see there's uh, like a lot of space you can uh, keep a lot of stuff inside and uh, the circuit is simple and uh, you can see here I have separated this so that uh, this electrical board doesn't like the wiring stays inside it doesn't come outside in this place and it's also smooth there's only a small mark over here uh, that's not nothing so as you can see the top uh, just off and on the lady as you can see now it's so dark now it's bright uh, and uh, I'll just close it and show you show it for you guys when you're closing nothing will happen to the uh, wires automatically get closed and these these two nails are for the handle and I just have to just close it like this then align it then click this button and when you try to pull it I'm putting my whole strength and pulling it doesn't work because it's locked I didn't uh, join these pieces because if I join it will be hard to open and close and now after it's locked just uh, off the machine and keep it away when you want put it and use it and that, that's it guys uh, as always please make sure you subscribe and a like would be appreciated and stay tuned for the next video